Hi, I'm Stu from Brit Hikes Ontario and I thought I'd set up a channel on YouTube to record some of the hikes and the walks that I go on in the province. I moved here about 10 years ago and I like to get out and explore the nature and learn more about the province around me. So today I'm in Thompson Memorial Park in the Scarborough neighborhood of Toronto and it's just a small park. It has a few trails going through the park but it also has some woodland and that's my favorite part and it's where I'm going to head shortly. It's a good time to be going for a hike in this area of Ontario. Spring has sprung, there's some uh, plants starting to sprout, migrating birds are also starting to land here. This is the West Highland Creek which weaves through Scarborough until it joins the Highland Creek and then eventually empties into Lake Ontario near Pickering. Well, the maple leaf is calling me To the true land of the free This yearning needs to be reconciled because I feel that I'll be welcome in the wild I believe that I'll be welcome Over the ocean and into the land Where humanity shows its true face Cause it's open and free And it's waiting for me can never be lost or found when you're taking the long way round nothing is guaranteed so i'll see where this pathway leads and i'll go where i like this style Thompson Memorial Park is named after John and Mary Thompson who moved to Newark in 1796. They were from Scotland. Newark is now known as Niagara-on-the-Lake. They spent some time there before moving to York which became Toronto and David Thompson actually helped build the first Parliament buildings before then moving to Scarborough. He fought in the War of 1812 and then uh, at some point in Scarborough he had an accident chopping wood which led to having to have one of his limbs amputated. That in turn led to complications from which he eventually died. He and his son actually built mills in Scarborough. Many of the family are actually buried at a church just outside of Thompson Memorial Park. So yeah, David Thompson from Westerkirk in Dumfriesshire, Scotland the first settler in Scarborough, where he cleared land. He arrived in Upper Canada in 1796, died on the 22nd of June 1834, aged 71. He had 11 children. Nothing is guaranteed so I'll see where this pathway leads. Okay, cool. This is Siberian squill or uh, Scylla siberica. It's not native to Ontario, but it's cool to see this plant flowering because it's one of the first flowers you'll see at the start of spring. So when you first see this flower, you know that spring is arriving. I hope to find a welcome. I hope to find a welcome. I hope to find a welcome in the wild 